<laughs> Barbershop Conversations, win the first five hours of your day. Click the link below. Share the video, y'all. Share the video. All right. Uh, hopefully everyone's having a great Saturday and uh, had a chance to listen to some Eddie Hearn interviews, about three or four of them. And uh, he said, there's going to be 12,000 people. One interview, he said 12. One interview, he said 14,000 people in Philadelphia. And, and, and it's amazing how Eddie Hearn is being celebrated for something I suggested four years ago. <laughs> but little Steven had all the answers and I was a crazy guy on YouTube. But I want y'all to know when y'all watching the Duran Ennis fight tonight, it was my plan. My plan. I created the plan. Now let's go to the co-main event. <laughs> this is my card, y'all. Y'all talk about the greatest. I am the greatest advisor in boxing history. Yes. Jerron Ennis and Jaleel Hackett took my advice. They didn't take my, they didn't, they're not going to say it came from me. They're going to say it was their idea. The people going to say it was their idea. I said this all during COVID, man. You are Jerron Ennis is a part of the boxing Cold War. Cold War. Jaleel Hackett is won't get any fights, and I was crazy. You can't do interviews with me, but look, it's my plan. This whole card is all about me. People are going to refute it and say, "Fred, you crazy? You jealous? Why don't you promote?" No, 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 no. I'm I'm in the Team Hawthorne business. <laughs> that it. That it. <laughs> You know what I mean? And, you know, um, that's all. That's all I'm in. The Team Hawthorne business. I'm not in nothing else. You know, Dre, Link, and Ken. That's it. That's it. Led by Frederick Hawthorne. That is it. That's it, dog. That's it, dog. Dog. <laughs> you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? So, and, I, and I'm going double and triple down. Like I said, Jerron Ennis is the most, since Gary Russell, the Darrell brothers, uh, Floyd Mayweather um, that I've seen with my eyes like amateurish uh, what's the other guy's name uh, Floyd Mayweather uh, I saw the Olympics of uh, of uh, of uh, uh, you know Captain Hook um, Roy Jones uh, I didn't see the 84 Olympics with my own eyes you know what I mean so I think the first Olympics I saw was 88 Seoul. I think that had David Rob that one had David Robinson in it. I saw oh that was the Goodwill Games. Was Bob Knight the coach of the 88 Olympic team? I think I don't know. I I feel like it was. <laughs> Anyhow, um, what happened to the Goodwill Games? Are the Goodwill Games still going? I remember watching that as a kid, man. You know, red, white, and blue. All that on Channel 4, remember? The Worldwide, World, ABC, Worldwide Leader in Sports, and they had boxing on NBC as well. Y'all remember the amateurs was being shown on NBC? And um, it, it's my card, man. It, it's, a, it's a barbershop conversation celebration, y'all. It's a barbershop conversation celebration. We, we, got our, we got our drink of choice. We healthy. I got athletic shoulders. Life is good. I'm working out. I'm about to end this video real quick and then finish my workout. Then I might come back and do another video. But it's all about me. Jaleel Hackett, Jerron Ennis, good luck tonight. Dobson is a hell of a fight. I wouldn't have taken the Dobson fight. I'm, I'm going to keep it a buck. And I wouldn't have moved up to 10 rounds. Nah, I, I wouldn't have did that. No, no, no. I thought you was a 154 guy. I didn't know you. I didn't know Jaleel Hackett was... 147. I didn't know that. I thought he was a. Has he fought at one at welterweight division? Has he fought at the welterweight limit? Mm -hmm. I don't know, but um, I have been keeping up with him. But uh, I thought he was a bigger guy. Than he looked like a bigger guy. I haven't seen him in person in a few years, but he looked bigger than 147. You know, but that's the competitive advantage you create. If you can make the weight, you can fight. I I don't believe in weight bullies. No, because in, in camp, the one who's quote unquote not a weight bill, who's not a weight bully has the advantage. On fight night, the other one does because he gains more weight, right? So 
you know, you got to make them pay. You know, like Floyd Mayweather did Canelo. You know, you got to get that. You got to get that power. You got to get that leverage. So anyways, y'all go ahead and have a beautiful day. Good morning to the world. Uh, uh, it's a great day to be Team Hawthorne. It's a great day to take the advice of barbershop conversations, man. This is a Team Hawthorne card. Let's have a toast. Let's have a toast to the douchebags. Let's have a toast to all the people in the comic session that didn't believe. Let me give my acceptance speech. First, I want to give honor to God, who's the head of my life. I want to thank Andrea, Lincoln, and Kennedy, Team Hawthorne. I want to say thank you because today is the first day where we have living proof where I am literally a genius. I am literally the freest and the smartest man in boxing. I have, I have never promoted a fight, but today I've promoted a fight. Today, I advise the fight. Today, I have led two fighters to the ring. Today, the boxing world is watching my advice come to fruition. Fruition is a big word for the baby daddies. No, it's not a fruit that come off the tree. It's not a juicy fruit. I'm not talking about bubble gum. Fruition. I'm not talking about water, okay? But go to Webster's Dictionary or ask Siri, how to, what's the definition of fruition? Okay, today is a special day. Today, I am the man. I don't have to pay salaries. I don't have to pay for logistics. I don't have to pay for the promotion. But today is a Barbershop Conversations promotion. Today, Jerron Ennis and Jaleel Hackett takes my advice. You are Tonight, when you're watching the zone, I have to pay no bills for this. And mind you, I'm not getting paid for this. I'm going to get paid in hate, not in celebration. I'm going to get paid in hate. I'm going to go finish my workout because... Y'all can see I'm in good shape, you know, and uh, th that's the, so I can play with my kids in the backyard. And while you gaining 30, 40 and 50 pounds and and, um, you know, doing all that and you was drunk last night, you watching this video hungover. This is for you, douchebags. This is for you, for you fake fathers. This is for you, for you fake pole boys, dough boys, pole boys, dough boys. You know, what I mean, this is this is for you. I'm him. You know, what I mean. I'm him. And I don't have to go by no pronoun. Call me Mr. Frederick Hawthorne. You go by pronouns. I don't need a pronoun in my life. I don't need DEI for a, a step up. I don't need Eddie Hearn to promote my I don't need Eddie Hearn to pay for my last name. I don't need Bob Aaron to pay for my last name. I don't need Al Heyman to pay for my last name. You do. You do. And this is why this is a toast to Team Hawthorne today. Team Hawthorne today. This is a, this is a great day. You know what I mean? Because in 31 minutes, I could... This video was seven minutes. It was 38 minutes when I came off. Team Hawthorne is landing in Japan. You know, Team Hawthorne is going to have a great time in Japan. And Grandma and Grandpa are going to see their ancestors and family. And, you know, and, and Dad is going to go work on the properties. I'm, as you guys know, I'm building equity. I'm building up Team Hawthorne as we speak, literally as we speak. And it's just a beautiful day. So I'm going to get off this line. I just want to say thank you. The haters, y'all keep hating, but the people that celebrate me, I love you. Team Hawthorne, I don't worry about the haters. I just give them a little bit, a little bit to hate me more. Hate me more. You can hate me now, but I, I don't even care about the haters, man. The haters didn't make this smoothie. You know what I mean? The haters didn't build this mansion. The, the haters didn't help me get in shape. I, I'm willing to bet you all my haters are fat. 98% of them are fat. I'm willing to bet you. 98% of them are fat. Ain't no in-shape man worried about it. Hey, I'm telling you, in-shape people, you know what they focus on? Calories. You know what they focusing on? Longevity. <laughs> Longevity. I don't ask Siri, baby daddies, how you do, what's the depth? Anyways, I'm going to hang up. I'm going to go finish this workout. Y'all go ahead and have a great day. Let's have a, this is a toast. Toast to Team Hawthorne, Barbershop Conversations, and all the people that believed in me. Thank you. I accept my award. <laughs>